Hi, this is Peter from Spirefix Pro, and welcome to a tutorial series. In this lesson, we'll show you how to start Windows in safe mode. To start Windows in safe mode, shut down your computer if it is already on and restart it. Once you power your computer on, the BIOS screen will show up where you may see the BIOS post messages. At this point, you should start pressing F8 in order to get to the Advanced Options screen. Now, on some computers, pressing F8 after the BIOS screen will bring up a boot device menu. Press escape to close this menu and continue to press F8. If done correctly, the advanced boot option screen will appear and here you can choose which Windows mode you wish to start. I highly recommend you boot into Windows safe mode with networking since this will allow you to connect to the internet and access websites that you may need. Press enter to make your choice. After you make your choice, Windows will start loading default drivers it needs to boot up into safe mode. During this process, it may appear Windows has crashed, but give it a few minutes. Afterwards, the familiar Windows login screen will appear shortly. Now, you can log in with your user account. Notice the low video resolution. This is due to Windows using a default video driver. To let you know that you are in safe mode, Windows will display a help screen telling you about safe mode. You don't need this help screen, so just close it up. In addition, you may notice the words safe mode are on all four corners of your desktop. Now you can begin troubleshooting or you can bring up Internet Explorer and access any website. For example, if you have a virus or spiral infection, you may want to access our website www.spiralfixpro.com. On our website, you can find detailed spiral and virus removal instructions, along with the latest spiral prevention tips. Our website is updated daily. I hope this video lesson has helped you. Again, please be sure to check out www.spiralfixpro.com for the latest spiral removal and prevention tips. Until next time, this is Peter.